Hi guys, welcome to Ria Mommy's Kitchen and Gardening Show. Today we are going to make a kid favorite, macaroni and cheese. Let's see what are the ingredients we need. Heavy whipping cream and milk, macaroni, cheddar cheese and mozzarella cheese, all purpose flour, Italian herbs and garlic powder and butter. Let's get cooking. Cook the macaroni as per the instructions given in your packet. Now, okay, put. macaroni is boiling. Let's make the macaroni and cheese sauce. Okay, now we're going to melt some butter onto this pan. After the butter is melted, we're going to stir the flour into this without make any lumps or until it's just really smooth. Now that the butter has fully melted, we're going to add the flour and mix it into a smooth paste. Roast the flour and butter together nicely. You'll, you'll get the roasted smell once it's fully roasted and at that time, we're going to add the milk. It's roasted enough we're going to add the milk so I've added half milk and half of whooping cream for my mac and cheese so that way it will have a rich texture wow keep stirring it make sure it does not burn at the bottom make sure you keep stirring continuously so that way there aren't any lumps and scrape to the bottom so that way it does not burn as you can see here, it's slowly getting thicker as we, as we stir. Now that it's thickened enough, we can add the salt, garlic powder, and our herbs. Let's stir them in. macaroni has cooked enough, we're going to drain it. Now that the sauce is thickened enough and cooked enough, we're going to add the cheese. At this time, you can switch to a whisk because it's easier. Now, keep stirring until all the cheese melts into the sauce. Mix it nicely into the sauce. Wow, did you see the macaroni? He looks so delicious. Now our mac and cheese is ready. But just to give a little flavor, flavor pop, I'm going to do one final step. Okay, so now transfer the macaroni and cheese into a, a bowl like this. Now we're going to sprinkle some cheese on top and we're going to bake it in 350 degrees Fahrenheit for 10 to 15 minutes. Now our mac and cheese is finally ready. Now it's tasting time. Mmm, it's so good, I love it. That sauce, all the cheeses and everything, it's so nice and since we baked it in the oven, I love the part where there's like <laughs> baked cheese. And it's just so delicious. Okay, if you like this video, try this video, give me the feedback. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe my channel. Until then, bye from Ria.